LEGO Jurassic World Set 75920 Raptor Escape. It is 394 pieces, 39.99 US dollars. This is the review of LEGO Jurassic World set 75920 Raptor Escape. The minifigures here both have good detail. They have a two part weapon on Barry here. He has a good front and back torso detail, while the front of his face is the only part with any expression. Vet here has a three part dino prod electric lance type thing. He has a basic and surprise facial expression to cover up with his horrible bull haircut and his paint to go with his torso and back actually are both really nice. Good metallic look on the Jurassic World emblem on the back part of the torso. The two raptors that come with the set are Charlie and Echo. They both are exactly the same. Both have three points of articulation in the jaw, full 360 degree articulation in the neck, and as far as the legs go, they could articulate as far as you want, but the body limits them to this movement shown here. It's pretty standard. Nothing more than be reasonable for this though. The back tail here is a rubbery plastic material that looks like it'll have some articulation, but really it's limited. It's basically just the rubber value, but if you bend it too much, it's gonna stick anyway. Echo here is just exactly the same. Got some nice detail on the back. It's more of an olive tone overall. Both of the nails and toes on both of them are black. They do have good paint, it is very even, it is really well detailed and there's good structure behind them. Here's all four of them side by side, so they're a nice collection to go along with a $40 set. There actually are a good amount of spare parts, here is shown all of them. Here's a top view of the main set, it's more of like a pentagon shape. The actual tower here to go along with it has good detail, it's got a nice trigger mechanism which will be shown here in a minute. Here's the whole set just overall. But as far as it goes, it's a good size for a 394 piece set to go for $40. It's a good piece to price ratio. Here's the main gimmick. You can slide the actual meat back and forth and then the raptors are supposed to eat it. The chicken leg itself, you can hold with the arm. This is the set that goes with it. There's a sticker on the front and back for this car. It's a nice little vehicle to go along with it. There's good articulation here for the missile point that comes with most of these newer sets. The gate here is well rigged up, it's nice pieces go along with it. There's three stickers on the signs. You can lift it and raise it here, there's back points, can hold it in place but you don't really necessarily have to, it holds its own really well. The electric fence here is very convincing, it's a nice little look. It's got the cool little Jedi lightsaber bar to hold, make it look like an electric arc type thing. The main function of the set is this falling tower, which can be knocked down by smashing something against this panel to let the Technic piece let go of the articulating section of the platform. Vet falls to his doom here, and the raptors eat him alive. 